when's the last time you took a dip in water heated by an active volcano? <laughs> Kathy and Scott, empty nesters turned adventure seekers. We've taken the leap into a brand new life by donating all of our belongings, keeping only what fits in two suitcases each, then saying goodbye to family and friends and boarding a plane out of Canada. And here, in the beautiful country of Costa Rica, the adventure continues. <laughs> Today we are heading out from San Luis, right? Yep. Yeah, which is San Luis. <laughs> Where we've been staying for I don't know, a few weeks. weeks. Yeah. Um, and we are going to Tabacon Hot Springs. So that is up around the lake this way and around there on the other side, down to the other end there. So that's where we're going today. <laughs> yep. Okay, so were you being facetious there? Yeah, I was a little bit. Initially, or you're saying that well, it, it is, is enjoyable. It is beautiful country, but if you're the driver, you can't really enjoy it as much. No. As wow. <laughs> you could go to the Cafe Macadamia. Mm-hmm. We could. We could. Why not? tiny breakfast sandwich. I thought it would be a little tiny breakfast sandwich. And then I got this small little typical breakfast sandwich. Desayuno. Desayuno. Typical desayuno. That's a breakfast sandwich. I haven't tasted like something like that since we left home. When you're thinking of breakfast sandwiches, right? Okay? Well, yeah, that's good. Okay, I can't wait to get one. That's good. Food in Costa Rica is really, I think there's only been maybe one or two places we've eaten where it's kind of been less than stellar. But the ingredients that are used. Yeah, they're delicious. Really, they're really, like you can tell they're fresh, but not factory produced. I have, one, I have one little complaint about the dining experience that we typically find. Like little squares of toilet paper for now. And almost the same density. Yeah, just a minor, minor little observation. It's not even like plain. I am so full, but that was delicious. What did you think about yours? It's just too much. It's very good. It was kind of a sandwich the size of your head. <laughs> um, that's the first leg of our journey to Tabacon. I don't think we mentioned that this is the Macadamia Cafe. All right, if I can get up from the table. It is beautiful here. It's gorgeous. Obviously, we're just hit with the beauty of the place, so we, we can't wait to look around. We're, our room's not quite ready yet, so we'll um, just go for a little walk around. Given uh, a welcome drink. Cucumber lemonade. 
and we were given towels with lemongrass on them to wipe our hands and face. Yeah, it smelled delicious. Delicious. It smelled invigorating. We've been, <laughs> we've been here, I don't know, all of five minutes and it's already, we're being pampered. Yeah. It just feels so wonderful. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Oh, that's delicious. Yeah. <laughs> and now we're going to our room. We're getting driven into our room. In the golf cart. <laughs> well, we have two places, the hotel here and the hot spring around 300 meters. We have two options to go there. We offer a shuttle that you can get in the front. But if you want to walk, it's possible. Just you have to go out, then to the right, and walk around five minutes. Okay. We have a sidewalk over there. Okay. okay. We're coming from Tilleran. <laughs> <laughs> We've been staying there for two weeks. Uh, we, we've been in Costa Rica for... Oh, you live in Costa Rica? Uh, oh, no, well, we don't live here. We've uh, been here since... September. September. Yeah. Oh. But originally we're Canadian. Canadian. Oh, okay. And do you speak Spanish? <laughs> Aprendiendo <laughs> Español. <laughs> Just you need to know one word in Costa Rica? Puerto Vida. Is, is, no. Oh. <laughs> one more beer. Oh. One more beer, oh, no <laughs> más. Una cerveza más. <laughs> you can open your room with your bracelet. Bracelet, okay. While I bring your luggage. Okay. okay. out my inner kid a little bit. There's all these little rivers, little streams, and there's nooks and crannies that you can explore. And, you know, all of a sudden you're floating and there's a waterfall. It didn't take more than a second for you to turn the whole world upside down. Had you been watching and waiting from some place up above, somehow knowing in this place all these people I'll find. Down it goes, we stick. Yeah, it's not that kind of food. <laughs> yeah. Now you have to explain what food stick is to people that might not know. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 
from people. And what they do is they find stick and they drop them in the water on the top of the bridge on the on the upstream side of the bridge. And then they run to the other side of the bridge to see who stick comes out first and the other stick comes out first swim. And I cannot wait to get to know To help ease the troubles on your mind To walk by your side Holding your hand in mine I'll treasure that for as long as I'm alive Your way Tired of this one already? There's so much to see. Yeah. So no, fun. Let's go to the next spot. It's really kind of fun exploring all these little paths and nooks and crannies uh, here at the uh, thermal, thermal Springs. You turn a corner. I, I thought we saw everything. Yeah. <laughs> There's always something new. I think I could get lost quite easily if that wasn't true. <laughs> Yeah, it's really kind of cool. Just wandering through the jungle on these little paths that take you to the little surprises around the corner. Well thought of. Food and it's snack. Yep. And I say it that way because I feel like, oh, we're all through through and stuff. Hmm. Who's gonna your food? Yeah. Warm organic asparagus and green bean salad. Well, that sounds delicious. Oh, filled avocado with cashew seeds, cherry tomatoes, and mushrooms. That sounds good. Too. With lemon and leaf dressing. Oh, this place is just amazing. Kathy. It has a bit of a challenge finding vegetarian food sometimes. That's, um, it's that's, that's not, yeah, and yeah. it's not, it's sort of, well, I tell you, I tell you. <laughs> um, I've found that oftentimes the vegetarian options have broccoli, eggplant, uh, zucchini, and I'm, that's fine. That sounds lovely, right? But that's on nachos. <laughs> Or pizza. Or pizza. Or, you know, or so, pretty much everything. So yeah. sometimes I don't want broccoli and eggplant. And so asparagus sounds great. Yeah. They have wellness cocktails. Yeah. 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 <laughs> They're good for you. It yeah. says, it, it says it so. It says so. It says wellness, wellness cocktails. What we were saying about napkins and Costa Rica earlier. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Real life. Can tell you're in a really high class place. And it's not it's smelled for toilet paper. And it smells very good. Oh, yeah. 10 points for presentation. This was a container that had a lid on it. She brought it over like this and then took it off and presented. So, yeah. Lovely. I'm going to take a bite and let us know what you think. So, stuff, avocado with and a flower. hearts of palm. Mm. 
Oh, it's very good. You can eat the flour. Okay. Try the flour. Well, they don't put inedible garnishes on food. Have the flour. Come on. Why? Why? Because you will love it. You just like to get me to do weird things. They would not put it on there if it wasn't meant to be eaten. The whole thing. I don't want the green bet. Why? <laughs> Eat your greens. <laughs> You see, not the part that, it's like eating pea shells. Thanks. What's that? Right now, uh, we're in an area that's strictly for hotel guests only. So, we're part of the elite. This is an area that you can have a drink and there's no kids allowed and stuff. There are no kids allowed? 18 and over. Oh, is that right? oh, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> oh, pretty. Look. This would be good as our regular every okay, this or something better. As our regular everyday view, that. I think I'd like that to be my view all the time. I think we might need to plant some plants. We're in a jungle. It happens naturally. <laughs> yes, but you can buy tropical plants. But what? Why? <laughs> Look, wait a minute. Why? Why what? Well, why buy tropical plants when we just go outside and do that? Well, for sure, but, but like that, together with that, together with that, is all... Natural jungle. Well, no, come on, this was, this was landscape. Saying I want to grow that. Why not? Those are cool. <laughs> you are bugging me that I want to get yeah. It's this spot right here. Yeah. Okay. I'm not playing. Fine. Thanks for coming along with us as we explored Tabacon Hot Springs. It's been fantastic. If you're looking for a uh, place to feel luxurious and not taken care of, definitely recommend this place. And yeah, definitely took the couples away. Yeah. It's, it's, yeah, out of this world. So all of the food we've had here has been exceptional. The ingredients taste so good. <laughs> and, and great combinations of, of flavors that we haven't become accustomed to here yet. Yeah. yeah. The staff here at Capitan, uh, both at the hotel and at the thermal pool, really treat you well. Oh yeah, they've thought of every detail. Yep. Definitely makes you feel well taken care of. That's right. So, if you like this video, please hit, hit the thumbs up button. <laughs> if you'd like to see more, please consider subscribing. We'd appreciate that. And if you'd like to know when we have another video, hit the notification bell. What I call the dingy thing. <laughs> Thanks for coming along. Pardon me? You were just talking about greenies and amoebas. <laughs> I actually wasn't meaning for you to dunk your head like that. I... <laughs>
I bent for you to sit down. So, Kathy was just saying that she read on the line, which means it's true. That you shouldn't dunk your head under because there's brain eating amoebas in the water. And she wouldn't, she wouldn't, oh, she's a little bit worried. She got a little bit of her ear wet. And she had this great idea to do this shot with me. She thought it would be really funny with me in the waterfall, dunking my head under. And I, typical Scott, oh, okay, don't put on your nose. Dunk my head under. As soon as I lift my head up, I remember. Oh, brain eating a minute. I think that's a big exaggeration anyway. But I just wanted you to sit. I just wanted you to sit in the waterfall and do like that. But did you get the shot you wanted? I don't know. Oh, I'm not doing it again. <laughs>